to the millions in Hong Kong who have been peacefully demonstrating to protect your rights these past months. We stand with you. We are inspired by you. And we urge you to stay on the path of nonviolent protest. But know that you have the prayers and the admiration of millions of Americans. And far too many American multinational corporations have kowtowed to the lure of China's money and markets by muzzling not only criticism of the Chinese Communist Party, but even affirmative expressions of American values. Nike promotes itself as a so-called social justice champion. But when it comes to Hong Kong, it prefers checking its social conscience at the door. Nike stores in China actually removed their Houston Rockets merchandise from their shelves to join the Chinese government in protest against the Rockets general manager's seven-word tweet, which read, fight for freedom, stand with Hong Kong. And some of the NBA's biggest players and owners who routinely exercise their freedom to criticize this country lose their voices when it comes to the freedom and rights of the people of China. In siding with the Chinese Communist Party and silencing free speech, the NBA is acting like a wholly owned subsidiary of the, that authoritarian regime. A progressive corporate culture that willfully ignores the abuse of human rights is not progressive, it is repressive. When American corporations, professional sports, pro athletes embrace censorship, it's not just wrong, it's un-American. American corporations should stand up for American values here at home and around the world. <laughs>